Hi, good morning, everybody. I'm sorry, I'm running a bit of a fever. I'm tired. I only get one day off this week, so I'm trying to keep my promise and get a sale in for you. Um, I do have clearance items as requested. Some of them are fossils. I do have some new things. People requested some new things. So it's kind of all over the spectrum that I'm showing you what kind of projects that I'm working on. They have time. So I am on shift until next Wednesday. So if you're interested in anything, please know that I can't ship it out until Wednesday. I realize that's only a few days, but I still want to let you know, you know, so you don't get, <laughs> get upset that they don't go out until Wednesday. Uh, the prices I quote you uh, are shipped to your door. So nothing's added, no shipping, no anything like that. So we're still testing that. USPS has still found a way to get around that. Um, yeah, I, I sent out a bag last week that they had the nerve to charge me $34 for. Really? It's going to California. It wasn't a bag that much bigger than this. But come on. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep doing that or if it's, it, they say, oh, it's the size and the place that it's going. Well, Okay, I understand it's going to California. California is more expensive, but give me a break, man. Come on. Really? I am not going to upcharge $40 so that I can send something like this to California. It only cost me $5 more to send a beautiful lady in Canada her bag. Hello. This is ridiculous. So... I have checked out Pirate Ship. I have checked out a few other um, avenues. So I think going forward, I'm going to just order some regular boxes because if you, you can't use the priority boxes, obviously, or get some, cause I have a, like a, a million of them. So maybe I'll get some shipping paper and go that route. Um, I did try pirate ship for one bag. It was fairly big and, and it was, it was pretty decent using an outside source. So <sighs> I'm going to find a way around USPS. So we're going to get it figured out. So still, along with this sale, the price I quote you is going to be all you have to pay. So I am going to start with the new Buck Dooney. I showed you this before. So upon closer inspection, I did notice I got a pin mark here and I got a pin mark here. So I am reducing the price of this bag. It was professionally cleaned. Um, now that I'm looking at it again in the light, I'm not real happy with it, but it is Nubuck. It is very soft. I do believe it's Nubuck. It is a Florentine. It's a beautiful, beautiful, really expensive bag. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and knock some money off the price. Still real gorgeous. Still got the back flap. You know, still a Florentine. Still a beautiful bag. But if you see in the light here, um, I didn't notice it the first time around that I am absolutely not happy with that. It's not up to my standards. So I did knock $30 off the price. So if you are interested in this gorgeous, gorgeous bag, I'm going to ship it to you for $125. And it'll be all yours. You know, there's a lot of people that don't think that's a big deal. And they they do really well with this really soft Nubuck style leather. I think that they might not have cleaned it properly. And for me to have a pin mark on there that I didn't have when I took it to them, I'm really aggravated about. So, but anyway... You know, it's still just a beautiful, larger Florentine. So, get a deal now. $125 shipped to your door. Because, quite frankly, there's nothing I'm going to be able to do to this without ruining it. Because we all know my relationship with Suede and Nubuck um, is a very volatile one. And Mama can't deal with that. So, my mistake is your game. So there you go. Oh, 
I did have a, a lady email me and ask me if there was a rip inside here. So one of the reasons why I wanted to show it again, I don't know if she thought she saw that and thought that was a rip and what have you, but I guarantee you there's no rippies. There's no scientific experiments. It's beautiful. The inside is just lovely. So you got the bigger pocket. Um, yeah. So, I mean, there's some people out here that do wonderful things with this kind of leather. I just can't. But please, by all means, grab yourself a bargain. Absolutely. 125 it comes straight to you. Next, let's do a clearance. How about that? All right. So, you're asking for clearance. I do have a clearance bag. Here we go. And they asked for a fossil clearance bag. So here we go. Black leather. What is that sticking in the front? I don't know. That can be one. <laughs> I just saw a flash of white. Yeah. This fossil. You see here? It needs a leather refresher. Does have some fading. Brass hardware. Well, yeah. Antique brass hardware. It's a beautiful bag. Just has some fading. I can color refresh it, but then I'm not going to sell it on clearance if I clean it all up and make it beautiful. With the things going on in my life and my having to move and what have you, I don't have time. And it's big, thick, luscious pebble leather, as those fossils are. What is that? It is driving me insane. I thought I had that wiped off. Sorry, guys. I can't, I can't win them all. <laughs> So, but I don't know if you're going to be able to see inside, so I'm going to try it. See, oh, there you go. Briefly cleaned inside. Let's see if I can pull the, pull it out a little bit. Let's see. Got your zipper pocket. Got your little fossil creed. Got your other fossil creed. Just needs a little color refresher. So it's a big, it's a bigger bag. It's not as big as the Mamba Jamba one I still have. I don't know if you guys remember that. Mine had the, the brown. I still got it upstairs. I'm thinking about it. It's about twice the size. <laughs> but that's in pristine condition. There you go. This I bought for a project bag. And quite honestly, lovelies, I'm not going to get to it. Look how tired I am now. So... It is in beautiful condition. Just needs a refresher. So if you want me to hold on to it and refresh it, it won't be on clearance anymore. I will sell it for $65. If you want it today, as is, and you want to refresh it yourself, I will ship it to you for $30. So that choice is up to you. Send me an email and let me know. But this is a really, really nice bag. It's just got a little fading. So... That's a clearance. And then I do have a Kate Spade clearance. There we go. This is one of the older ones. It's big, thick, really soft leather. Real thick. They don't, you know, beautiful handle. It's too small for me. You don't have all the weirdness. I shouldn't do a clearance on it, but let me tell you why I'm doing that. You see this right here? You'll need a little color touch up right there. It's like a it's like a little bit of a scratch. But I see it. And the hardware wearing a little bit of this. Wearing really cool. It's like red under there. It's it's like gold over um, bronze. It, it looks really cool. So I mean it's it's in beautiful condition. Um, the inside here is nice. It's got Needs to be wiped out a little bit. Again, it, it, you know, you could probably, it's real clean down in there. You could probably take, you know, um, I would, 
to do a, a cleanup, I would use like a, a non-alcohol baby wipe and go over that. Um, there's no pin marks or anything like that in there, so I wouldn't use anything alcohol-based. I wouldn't want to pull up any of this beautiful pink color. See the hardware? So yeah, it's actually in really nice condition. I just don't have the time to give her the love she needs, but it'll need, you know, a little bit of, say, the, the Kiwi Black Leather Dye and a Q-tip. Boop, boop, beep, boop. And wipe the inside out. I suppose I could do that. Um, but why not get a Kate Spade on clearance if you can get a Kate Spade on clearance, right? So for $50 shipped to your door, Kate Spade on clearance. It has no other issues. It is beautiful. Some of the Kate Spades I see now, I mean, they're still doing like the style, but look how thick it is. The, it is, they just, not the same. <laughs> not the same, my friend. There we go. So let me know what you want me to do, because if you want me to clean it up, um, you know, she's going to end up being 65. So. As is 50, 65 if you want Badger to have a go at it. Okay. The Betsy Johnson gift set is next. This, I picked up a couple of these for Christmas. I sent Kristen one as a trade for some awesome glasses. They're still kind of big for my face. Mm. So, I'm going to take them somewhere else. And see if they can't heat them up, make them a little... I think maybe they're just too big for my face. Nice. Here, look at this. Watch me dump this on the floor. Okay. So, it's a puppy bag. It's super cute. I got a couple of these at Christmas time. It's got a little coin. <laughs> so, retail, $78 on it. <laughs> these were just so cute I had to pick them up at Christmas time and I'm going to go ahead and if I'll even show you the box you know, so the Betsy Johnson gift set still even has you know little puppies little Pomeranians and stuff on there <laughs> so it is brand new you see that so $60 shipped to your door there you go you could probably get it you know and Keep it closed up and give it as a gift. I would tie the bag back in there so that you don't get on the videos like I just did and drop it like 85 times. So, <laughs> so and you know, for Betsy Johnson fans, I have probably, I had find them because you know, funny things. Um, a lot of Betsy Johnson wallets, brand spanking new with the tags. Um, you know, this is so cute. Okay. So if you're interested in those, I, I would put them in a sale. There you go. And speaking of wallets, I found this cute little brand new with tags. Um, it's like a leather. It's not a leather. It's like a pleather plasticky, but it's, it's Disney. It'd be cute for a child. What have you. Brand spanking new. Um, give it to a little girl. Use it for yourself. Whatever you want to do. Um, so I found this. So this is going to appear with somebody's order. You know, I like to drop goodies in people's orders. So there you go. So this will appear. So there you have it. So, I mean, just, just the, this. I, I can't get over how cute this is. And Kristen loves hers. So, if anybody's interested, 60 bucks shipped to your door. To all yours. Brand spanking new. And it is the cutest dog thing I've ever seen. It is really, really cute. So. I have another. Now, I'm going to show you one of my rehabs. When I got this tote, it was a hot mess. And I wasn't sure if it belonged on, uh, uh, it, 
I'm not go. I'm not into the bright shiny gold, but it has come up so nice. I thought that I would show you guys the rehab. So I didn't stuff it like I should have. A little bit more. It's a Kate Spade polka dotties, and yeah, it's that shiny. It had things and. It, it was a hot mess, but this one was completed. <laughs> See yourself in there? She's now in beautiful condition. Super fun. There's a little Kate Spade logo there inside the bow, if you can see it. And I'm trying to use my phone here. There you go. You can see the... <laughs> it's a fun bag. It's now, now classy. So... It wasn't looking so classy when I started it. So I've been working on this bag for a solid week. So, let me take some stuff out of here for you. We can have a look. Nice. So, beautiful Kate Spade. It's got the gold Kate Spade emblem in there. There you go. Pull the insides out so you can see it. You got your two open pockets and your zipper pocket and your little Kate Spade tag here. So she is loud. She is proud. <laughs> she's, she's not a small one either. So I should have stuffed her a little bit more. She does have. Oh, look at you see it right there, right there. I'll have to wipe it down just a little bit more I'm not sure if that's a scratch or I mean it was a hot mess I'm not oh. it was McNasty that I like to say it's McNasty I, I hope that that drives home something that is so but she is really cool now probably not everybody's cup of tea but it's a beautiful Kate Spade now super fun <laughs> I hope somebody enjoys her so, I put a lot, a lot of time into her. It's 65. Can't believe I lost my place. So, I've taken some, uh, you know, like Dayquil and some things. Things are like that are going around. Um, I have four people on my team that work for me at work that are out for COVID in, in Illinois. I don't know if it's Illinois or here. Um, I've got a weird, like a weird rash on my leg. I'm not feeling good. The fevers are coming and going. Um, the, I, I don't know if it's another strand of COVID, but it's going around. I actually, after I'm done recording here, am heading to the doctor to get tested. Um, because I'm not, <laughs> I'm not feeling well again. So I, you know, that, that would make a lot of sense because the last couple of times that I've I felt better with the last one. Remember, I was all kicking around and doing a happy dance, happy with my phone. But a couple before then, yeah. I, hmm. But I'm only getting one day off, so I'm doing it today so I can find out. I'm getting the two-hour test before, you know, I go to work tomorrow. <laughs> so, here you go. So, a little backstory. Well, probably a little too much information for you, but, you know kind of explain what's happening so that is <laughs> so the polka dot tart that is 65 I put a lot of love into her she's very great and absolutely worth it I already showed you the clearance fossil with the pit the with the front pockets so if you remember it's gonna be 65 if you would like me to rehab it or it's 50 on clearance as is I'm gonna let you figure that out this is a gift I got from my dad a while back. I think I've shown this. It is a belt pouch, vintage coach. It's got a little bit of here. I used to use it. Right now, uh, back when I was in college, my dad gave me this. And I put mace in it. Yeah, so. And I don't carry that now. Now I have those Gucci sunglasses. I'm also going to reduce these. So if you're interested in these Gucci sunglasses, 
which I will wipe down and sanitize because I'm touching them just in case. They, you know, they, they are awesome. They're just a little too small for my face. So if you're interested in these, $55. Cutting that price almost in half. $55 shipped. And these Gucci's will be yours. So, let's see here. Got, I don't know, close enough you can see. There we go. I don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera. Your serial numbers. Things like that. They are beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, yeah. So this is padded, so I thought I would stick these right on down in here because I don't have a case for the Gucci Goose. Sorry. So the vintage pouch, I'm only asking 35, and she's over. So that's pretty good. You can put it on your belt. Or you could buy the Gucci's and I can just send you the set. So it's 55 for the Gucci's and it's 35 for the, the vintage coach belt. I like to call it the mace bag. For its age, it's in beautiful condition. So, you know, and if, if you're interested in both, I'm happy to happy to do a deal. So that's like ninety dollars. It would be for the for the two of them. I'll do a flat eighty. If you want the Gucci's and the coach here, if you want the set, I'll ship it to you for eighty bucks. I don't have a case, but it's padded in there. It will protect it. You go vintage coach you never go wrong with it anyway so there you go so that's a nice little bundle deal for you if you're interested I have I removed it a brand new black lotus wallet black leather it's really soft it's a small one still got the little tags inside you got two little slip pockets here You've got the RFID, keep your identity safe, so it must be that big RFID thing. You've got two little card slots here, stamped genuine leather. Then it has a little coin. There you go. And then, of course, there's a place for your bills. There you go. This would be great for male or female. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Lotus wallet. So if you're interested in a Lotus wallet, it's $40 shipped to your door. Brand spanking new, black leather. It's a gorgeous wallet. Let's see. The next wallet I have for you is a Hobo International. And I've got it on clearance. Because, you know, as these hobos do, they fade and patina. But, you know, between you and I and these four walls, um, the Hobo Internationals are, are really pretty. But um, the teals, I don't think patina so well because when they patina, they look dirty. Um, it, I, I, it's just that color because, I'm, you know... I like my Hobo International and what have you, but yeah, it's not really coming up here on camera. It's being more vivid than what it really is. But if you get a little closer, you see what I'm talking about. I, 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 I believe me, it is. It's clean. So I'm gonna clearance it because I'm not. I'm not using it anymore, um, and I'm not going to dye it because. I don't have the time, you know, and I'm, I'm not so good where I, I'm not so good, I did it again, so good where I could dye it and not cover, you know, the hobo emblem and what have you. So if you're interested in the Hobo International 
clearance. Um, $30 shipped to your door. Just remember that that's with shipping too. So sometimes I don't feel right about asking the prices that I do, but the shipping's including in it. I know you all understand that, but I feel like, like, what are you out of mind, lady? So I'm still trying to get used to it. It's taking me out of my comfort zone. So there you go. I'm thinking about, and let me kick this off you. Um, I'm thinking about kind of doing uh, kind of what Hadrian kind of does. You know, he does a flat 15 for up to five items. And if I use the pirate ship and I use these others, that's not too unreasonable. And then you can have multiple items and you don't have to worry about it. Um, my USPS, like I said, is charging me $25, $40. $18 to ship little things and, it, and it's absolutely ridiculous I'm furious about it so yeah so $30 shipped to your door all yours I do have a really another nice Lotus this is a phone a phone wallet you can see where it says Lotus beautiful burgundy leather now it's fun because here's the foam part. Now I have the Samsung Note 20. And if I take it out of the case, it fits in there beautifully. So the bigger phones will fit. Then you flip it over, zip around the other side. And it has your under lock and key, Lotus RFID. And it has your pocket there. And you've got one, two, three, four, five, six card slots place for your bills, your credit cards, and anything else. So this is a nice phone phone wallet. I did ask Hadrian for one. I wanted one, and I forgot that I had this. It's in brand new condition. I've never used it. Um, but I was, I'm wanting something I can hang around my neck so that when I'm running around work, I don't have to worry about it. This I will, I will lose. So... If you're interested in the Lotus Phone Wallet, that's 45 shipped, and it is worth it. It is gorgeous. It will work. The next, here we go. Where did I stick that? There's so much stuff over here. I don't even know what to do with it all. Here we go. Next wallet. Nice vintage fossil wallet. Beautiful condition. Not all torn up. Opens up this way. Opens right up. Fossil on the inside. Beautiful. You've got one, two, three open areas. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight coin slots. Place for your bills. Zipper pocket. This thing is the bee's knees. There you go. Place for your coins. Really soft, beautiful leather. Vintage style. Not sure if it's vintage or vintage style, but it is gorgeous. So it just flips through here. It gives me Hobo International vibes. <laughs> this is a beautiful fossil. The leather is buttery soft. It's nice. So. Isn't it beautiful? I love it. Oh, it smells so nice. So the vintage inspired, I'm going to say vintage inspired wallet, um, is 55 shipped. Can't go wrong there. It's beautiful. It's like a burgundy and a darker burgundy brown in the middle. It's beautiful. Okay. <laughs> Oh, here it is. Okay, this used to be mine. So this is an old Badger wallet. Michael Kors. It's one of the older ones. It has real thick leather. And it's just soft, buttery soft. It's not the Safiano stuff and what have you. There you go. So... It does have some of the gold is kind of wearing off on it, but it's still beautiful. 
And what is that thing on there? Yeah. So that's how that's rubbing off. So it's got a little bit of wear. So this is reduced greatly. Beautiful inside now. Real thick leather. It's just luscious. One, two, three, four, five, six. Place for your bills. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 card slots. I don't know who would have 14 credit cards. I mean, I, have, I might have that many. <laughs> Open that, you know, it's got the zipper. So, it's in pristine condition. The leather is pristine. There's no rubbing. There's no, none of that funny business going on. This is one of the Badger wallets. Beautiful, beautiful Michael Kors wallet. So, if you're looking for something like that, it's going to last you forever. There we go. Beautiful. So, if you're interested in this one, the Michael Kors wallet, 45, reduced. I did have 55 on it. 45, shipped to your door. And Mr. Michael Kors could be all yours. <laughs> Next, I would like to show you something fun. The Patricia Nash Kiss Lock Wristlet. Isn't she fun? There's Patricia Nash. It's like, there's, there it is. There you go. <laughs> beautiful wristlet it does come with it's a little dust bag on the inside you got a zipper pocket you have one ruchi pocket another zipper oh no nope, two card slots three card slots a ruchi and a zipper because i don't know what i'm doing there you go beautiful inside there i used it briefly but, you know, I'm always teasing everybody, other resellers. You got anything that my wallet's going to fit into? So I needed something more substantial. Beautiful, excellent condition. So the Kiss Lock wristlet is $50 shipped. So this was one of mine. Another fun bag that we have. Not we have, I have. It's another Patricia Nash. Fun little crossbody. I don't know where the crossbody is. I've had this bag for a couple of years. When I used to carry exclusively Patricia Nash when I was on that bin, I do have a dust bag for it. It's not a Patricia Nash dust bag, but I have one your three openings there you got a big old zipper in the middle and then it has there you go the zipper pocket two ruchi pockets and then your two open on the side big thick leather it's absolutely gorgeous inside and out you won't can't go wrong with this one you can carry it by the hand or you can put a crossbody on it it does have the ear the rings for it. I just don't know. I included a dust bag. Patricia Nash, beautiful. That she deserves dust bags. This one's actually better than what you usually get with those. So it's a beautiful bag. So with the brass handle, Patricia Nash. She is $70 shipped to your door. There you go. She party. She party. Cute little bag. I just don't carry little bags anymore. I think I just have so much stuff. You know. <laughs> Next one I have, since we're on Patricia Nash. Let me show you this. And I'm stuck. I don't know why I'm stuck. I do have another brand new with tags. Trisha Nash and Green. <laughs> brand spanking new. And it is true to color green. Nice and vivid. It's got the braided 
details, crossbody, adjustable. I, I don't know if it's removable. Yeah, it's removable. There you go. Everything's in there, including her dust bag. So I've never opened it. She does have a built-in wallet feature. You've got some card slots, a place for your driver's license right there, and a zipper pocket. That's a nice little feature. The big ruchy pocket in the middle. And on the back side, and the back one is your Patricia Nash logo again. Here we go. And a zipper pocket. And there's the card. And another zipper pocket. And another zipper pocket. So there's lots of room, lots of compartments. Probably be able to fit your phone down in there. Let's put all the goodies back in here because I don't want to lose them. There we go. But she is one beautiful bag. Now for her, I keep the tags on her. She is $159 retail. And I am asking 90 shipped. So for $90, I will ship her to your home. Beautiful. I think somebody was looking for green bags. You're not going to get any more green than this one. Woo! Beautiful brand new. Next is a fun one. I didn't stuff it, and I probably should have. But I think I showed this before. This one is... Faux leather. I'm just warning you now. It's not real leather, but it is super, super fun. So, if you like Disney, you're going to love this one. This is super fun. Mickey Mouse bag. Anything else? Oh, I should have stuffed it better. <laughs> Isn't this the cutest bag you ever saw? Throw in the peace sign. Woo! The crossbody is inside. This is brand new. Never used. It is faux leather, guys. But it is a cool, cool bag. And that'd be neat. Yeah. That'd be absolutely cool, wouldn't it? So here you go. So if you are interested. In the Mickey Mouse bag, you just open it up. And I'm going to take all that stuff back out. Here's the crossbody strap. There's the inside. Super clean. So it has a zipper pocket, and then that is it. So Mickey Mouse is a lot, a lot of fun. So for Mickey Mouse, I had showed it before for 100 bucks. Now I'm going to ship it to you for 70 So 70 bucks, Mickey Mouse will come to you. That is just the neatest Mickey Mouse purse I've seen in a while. So he's 70. So next I have brand new with tags, Kate Spade's rose gold crossbodies in the metallic rose gold. I don't have one of these. I have two of these. It was a two for deal, and I took it chain crossbody. It is removable, so you can carry it in a handbag if you like. Pocket in the back. Cute little bow in the front. It retails for 349 bucks for this bad boy. Oh. I forget how to, okay. So you turn it. I've not taken any of the stuffing or anything out of it. So it's brand spanking new, and boy, did they got it so good. I don't know if I'm going to get all that back in there the same way they had it. Wow. Okay. Still got the little silica things in there. Kate Spade logos covered. Brand spanking new. So it has an open pocket, and it has three card slots. Brand spanking new. It's beautiful in there. The inside is beautiful. 
Whoever gets this bag is really, really lucky. So I do have two of these. So they're $349 brand spanking new to buy them. I think you can even still get them on the website. Not, don't quote me on that. I'm not 100% sure, but I've seen something like it. These will be $125 each shipped to your door. Brand new. $350 Kate Spade. Big, thick Safiana leather. If you like Kate Spade, I got you covered. So there you go. $125 shipped to your door for one of those. Next is a great one. This one is one of mine that I decided to let go. This is a big old Hobo International. This is a Badger bag. Beautiful condition. There you go. It does have a pocket in the back. It's got the suede inside. Beautiful condition. It's got a tassel on the side. Nice and cool. This is a nice bag. Just a flat top. I got stuff for the gills. There you go. So inside we have your two open pockets. Your zipper pocket. Another open pocket. It says Hobo International. There you go. Beautiful. Inside and out. Beautiful leather is consistent with the Hobo Internationals. There's no fading or anything like that yet. I made sure of that. So if you're interested in the Badger Hobo bag, that is 95 shipped. And I've been really ultra careful with it. Reason being, that suede on the inside. And, you know, me and suede have a long history of hatred for each other. Beautiful, pristine condition. So, somebody needs to get this and give her a how. She's not coming with me. Beautiful. So, $95, and she is all yours. So, project bags that I am going to do is this Kate Spade. It's very much like the, you know, Mark Jacobs in style. <laughs> so it's got it's got some issues so I like this bag enough but I like big thick black leather some of these other ones hmm. you know it's not that I don't want to do the fossils but it's Kate Spade man <laughs> so you know I mean if you are interested in this one it's going to be 55 shipped if I restore it I'm going to ask 75. This is a big, I can't really tell on camera, but this is one of the bigger ones. The, the leather is just immaculate. So it just needs a good cleaning, a good conditioning. Um, I need to do something with the interior, but the leather, there's no rubbing. There's no, none of this nonsense going on with it. So I like the older ones. They just don't make them like that anymore. You know, I like them to be weighty, you know, have things. This is another project bag. This is cool. This is really neat. So, and it's got this, this lock on it, the security lock thing. You, you take it, you push it here, and you pull it out, and it unhinges. So you can lock your bag up. So you can lock your bag up. Yeah, or you can tear it up. So. It's got a spring in there. Don't uh, push it that far. So this is a project bag. That goes right back in. It's just spring loaded. Right there. Now this is made by, now this has very Hobo International. It's, it's tanned like a Hobo International. This is by Francisco Biasia? Francisco? 
So the leather is just like Pueblo International. So it just needs to be cleaned up. The collar, I love the collar. Very spring. Needs cleaned out. So this is going to be my next project. I love the silhouette of the bag. So it's just bigger. This is one cool bag. So this is going to be a project. So I'm going to condition her up, make sure it doesn't have any issues and what have you. And yeah, and get it taken care of. So I'm not sure, you know, what I'm going to ask for this bag. But now I have to fidget with this because this is going to make me insane. Because this happened one time before. That spring comes out if you're not careful. So you have to be careful. But I will get it sorted. There we go. I will get that all fixed. Next, I wanted to show you guys real quick. My Michael Kors bag that I showed everybody. I'm going to be moving out of that and I'll be selling that. Long crossbody, removable. It's got the hardware. It's a cool bag. So, she's all taken care of. I just... I'm not sure what I'm going to sell it for yet, but I know I'm not going to keep it. So, I have about 85 more I want to get to. So if you're interested in this one, you know, shoot me a text, text, shoot me an email, make me an offer, whatever you would like to do. So, but this one will be going. It'll show up in another sale if I don't get any interest in it today. And I wanted to show what Purse Curator showed me, sent me. Vicki, I got it and my laptop fits in there perfectly. And this is confusing me a little bit though. I don't think it's reversible I'm not sure <laughs> but nice work bag yeah I got it and I love it yes so happy money well spent that's my work bag thank you purse curator everybody check her out look at this this is a quality you get from Vicky. Yes, ma'am. Look at that. Y'all seen that Michael to Kors giant tote I got from her. Ridiculous. Ridiculously big. Did you see it? The beautiful work bag. <laughs> beautiful. So that's the quality of stuff that she has. So you need to get, check her out. So I don't need this anymore. I'm debating. This is my mulberry. Email me, make an offer. It's in gorgeous condition. No grossness. Hardware looks nice. So if you're into mulberry, suede on the inside. So it wasn't conducive to, you know, having a laptop, but that's what I really had to put my laptop in. It has a zipper pocket above the mulberry, mulberry medallion. It has one slip pocket on the other side. Big, thick leather. This bag is beautiful and expensive. So if you're interested in that, let me know. You can talk it out. Beautiful. Beautiful bag. All right, so that will conclude for today. So get a hold of me, ask any and all questions that you have. Like I said, any prices that I quoted you today are included shipping. You should see this massive mountain of paper I have at my feet. I'm going to grief. I'm a glutton for punishment. Anyway, I love you all. So somebody's going to get this. My beautiful work bag. Thank you, Vicki. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo.
All right, so I hope that I showed what everybody was kind of asking for. So there you go. So if you're interested in anything, please remember, it'll be Wednesday morning before I can get it shipped out. That will give me a little bit of time. So, you know, if you're interested in a bag and you want it, or you want it rehabbed, you know, before I send it, um, I quoted the two prices, as is, and rehab. So shoot me a text. Love y'all. Stay crazy.